so just had the orders off the old man. Uh, I got to drive to Clenetley today. Uh, we got to move some communication materials, ducting and lids and other items up to the yard in Bridge End in Barakla. Um, so we're in hire today. Put the eye up, put the scanner, and uh, yeah, we'll see how we get on. So this is what we have been asked to pick up. Eight packs of cotton, eight packs of ducting, communication ducting, rope, collars, connectors and rubbers, more collars, chambers, and Freeman lids down there. All on here. Uh, this is going to be not straightforward as I thought it was going to be, and it's going to be. Uh, it's going to be at least three loads, I think. At least. Okay, let's see how we get on. Thank God, you had a forklift turn up. Save the day, because this would have took me absolute hours. Trying to sling all this on, wrap it up, job done. Right, let's drop this lot off. All off now, apart from the chambers. Ready to go back up in the air next loop. And I'm back up in Bridge End at the moment. Um, picked the lower ducks up last night and um, bring them back here now this morning. It was too late last night to bring them back. They said if we don't get back by half past three, the yard is far, we're not a chance to get in here. So we come back this morning, drop them off, and then we go back up to the left to pick another load up, a load of ducks up, and then bring them back. And then this afternoon, I think. Might be back on the ground wagon then, hopefully. So, shall we get on? Today, full day on the grab should be. I uh, got one in Abgaveni, got one in Dufferin, and I got a couple from uh, our site in Lamb Frankfurt. So, first one is Abgaveni, let's see how we get on. Yeah, we'll see. But now I'm off to Lambeth. 
spec for now for uh, some backup from a site that the power boys are all working on. Um, yeah, and I think I've got a tough for it after that, so uh, it's hopefully all this will go to plan now. in the book at the moment. Um, yeah, a bit slow on the old uh, bike, the old uh, ground front bike, so hopefully they'll pick up the mark and we'll be a bit more in. We'll see. Bad. 
all done. Friday, I just took my last load off. Uh, I can hurry up now, I have the weekend. All done, Friday, all done for the week now. Oh, there's a wagon, just took the last load off. Um, gonna book into for next week as of yet. Um, customers then, I just talked to them, said they got a uh, few loads the week after, but nothing next week yet. So, I guess we'll wait and see. I have. I have Got to go back down to Bridger and pick another two packs of porcelain and slabs up. Uh, that'll be Monday. And yeah, I think that is it as of yet. So we we'll shall see. Anyway, Friday, baby. Saturday. And I'm currently moving out of my house because I'm moving in with the missus. And I'm getting this house ready for rent then as well. Um, that's a plan today. Uh, might have a little surprise later. Uh, I don't know. We'll just, we shall see. So that's the plan at the moment. So I'm currently shifting shit. Let's see how we go. On. Okay, so we sat there. Yeah. We're what? in uh, Bradford and Avon, and uh, we're staying at this uh, room. Timberella's yard. Timberella's yard. Oh, what's the lights on here? No, no, no. Here we go. Woo! This is plush, isn't it? Beautiful. And then, we got this view of the river. Right, time for a quick shower and get on the beers. Later. It's more water. Stop it there. It's Monday now. That Sunday yesterday. We woke up uh, in Timbrell's yard in Bradford Haven. Beautiful hotel. Beautiful food, drink there as well. And then we went. For a walk around Bradford Avon, looked at the canal, had a, had a drink at, um, I can't remember what it's called now. Um, yeah, and then we went for the Sunday dinner at a restaurant called Bunch of Grapes, which is a Michelin star restaurant. And yeah, the food was shit. It was a new, we had lamb. And it just melted. It just, just to tore it off the bone. It just ah. And the veg lush, the gravy was lush. Oh my god, yeah. Definitely see why it's a Michelin star restaurant. Uh, we had that, and we just come on there and just chill, watch the Formula One. And then fell into a food coma basically because it was so full. I mean that was. Week one, uh, let's see how week two goes now. <laughs> 